Hey guys, RC here. We're back with Football Manager 21, our journeyman series. And uh, just taking a quick look, there's a look at the friendlies. 4-1 uh, win over Union. I don't even know. Block. Can't even read the name. Block. Block Market. No clue. Uh, then a 4-0 win over SC Carlsdorf. A 2-1 loss to Spal. And a 1-0 win over Empoli. Uh, Serrer with a goal. Cernan with a goal. Coley with a hat trick. Doyle with a goal. Amara. Serrer, another goal. Yopek and Hunter. So a lot of familiar names. Some of the newer names. Let's catch you up on transfers. I think Neil Lynch was the last one we saw. So we had one more coming in. And we did send out... Send out a couple of guys. So William Gislaine uh, goes off to Ascoli for 14.75. Um, he became expendable when we signed Abwander and Lynch. So we brought in two new center backs, and that made him expendable. Uh, we loaned out a couple of players, including the young Johan Schnitzer, who looks like he's going to be for real. And look where he's going. He's going to Schalke in the Bundesliga. So... I think he's pretty quality. I hope he really develops this year and jumps into action for us next year. The one player that we brought in, so we brought in 14.75. We turned around and spent just about all of that on Ivan Serrer from Boca. He's a left winger, and this puts Jack Hunter on the bench. <laughs> uh, but very, very good physically, crossing, dribbling, first touch. This guy looks amazing amazing uh he is left-footed so i guess we could cross train him as an inverted winger if we wanted to but that's uh yeah that is what it is uh real quick i just want to kind of catch you guys up let's look at the season preview uh we are picked to finish 13th at 50 to 1 the board expects us to finish top half i believe yep top half and the quarterfinals in the euro cup and taking a look, that's what I wanted. Uh, so let's take a look at Serie A last year. Just to kind of keep you guys up with what's happening around the world. Genoa won the championship there by three points. Uh, Juventus, of course, a lot of the same teams. There's Spal, who we just beat in the friendlies. And uh, those are the teams that went down. Taking a look at League Un last year. Uh, Lille won the league by one point, 88 87 over PSG. And Rims, Mets. Oh, Ren went down, and Paris Football Club went down on 22 points. Oh, we got to have a chat about that. I, I got chewed out at the end of last season by uh, an opposing coach. Uh, so that was interesting. Let's see. Last season in Spanish first degree, division, Real Madrid, Bilbao, Barcelona. So your same old, same old up there at the top. And in the Premier League, I made a comment that Arsenal had won. I don't remember. I think it was my other save. But there was something that Arsenal had won with like 75 points, and that was like a new, it must have been because they didn't win last year, um, 75 points won the league, and that was like a record low point tally for a Premier League champion. But Man City, Chelsea, Liverpool, Arsenal, Burnley, Newcastle, that's some interesting teams in, uh, in Europa League. Middlesbrough, Brentford, Tranmere, they got sent down. One Lincoln... Oh, there they are, Lincoln. Yep. So they just stayed up. Tottenham and Leicester got sent down. Wow. That's astounding. That is astounding. Leeds got sent down the year before. Tottenham must have just come up. Leicester as well. There's Tottenham. Liverpool got relegated. Holy shit. Tottenham again. 
what have they been doing? So relegated, promoted, relegated, promoted, relegated. Boy, they've just been yo-yoing every season. Wow, that is crazy. I wasn't expecting that when I looked. That's insane. All right, well, let's get to today's match for us. With the transfer news, we are going to uh, only have the one match. No highlights. I've gone to this 4-2-3-1 this year. We're going to give it a whirl. And uh, we're going to see a little bit of a mixture in here. So um, DeVos has garnered some attention from my assistant manager uh, over Yanderson. So we're going to give him a shot in goal. Uh, Krisnik is a new left back because Sahin's going to stay on right back. Yeah, so I think that's the guy. Krisnik, Avawander, Gunderson. Do I want Gunderson or do I want Lynch? Kramer's there too. I think we're going to go with Lynch. Both of our new guys. Not positive. 15 passing and 11 passing. So we'll try the ball playing defender. Sahin back at right back. Doyle and Matthews in the central mid. Uh, Matthews is one of our new players. We just picked him up on a free from Ipswich. And then Yopik on the right. Yashin in the middle at number 10. Uh, he is one of our new players. No, he's a, oh, he's a youngster. All right, he's in the farm system. Very good at passing. Okay, don't think that's who I want to play there. What do the rest of our guys look like? Coley, Sam. Yeah, why isn't Sam in there? Let's put Sam up there. Sorare has looked really good. Jack Hunter is struggling for fitness. Tell you what, we might sell him. If I could get money, because I like Sorare and Hunter. Oh, Hunter was up top. That's what it was. Um, he's on 430 a week and I'm not sure he's going to start every week he's good he's really good I like him a lot but we have brought some players in uh, I really want Aslani in there and Cernan is just so good yeah I don't know how I keep him out so let's go with that We'll have to, you know, we may end up having to move on a couple of players just that are making my my selection process too difficult. <laughs> All right, we're going to pump the fist. We're favorites for a reason. Let's get into it. We are in the white. There's Matthews. Out to Sahin. There's a cross in, knocked away. All right. Make sure we've got extended highlights on. Had a very odd... Con oh, there's a bounce over, and Cernan gets his first of the season. That's the first for us on the year. Looks like it got headed over the keeper. I'll have to look and see who got, who got their head on that. Doyle? Oh, the keeper went to punch it and it went over his head. Oh my God. I think he actually got his hand on it. He punched it, but he didn't punch it out. He, it, it just continued on behind him. Weird. That's astounding. Oh, there's a nice little one-two pass. Oh, I think he was offside, so he let it go. Second minute goal, liking that. Sahin with the long throw. And not sure what happened there. I couldn't see very well. All those names does make it a little harder to see, but I like all the names up, and you guys asked for that, so I'm cool with it. Out to Ash, As Aslani, and Sam takes a quick stab at it. Let's encourage, let's demand more. Yep. Good first touch by 
Pissinot or Pisno. Probably French, right? Edit out. So, yeah, we've got quite a few new players. It'll be interesting to see how that transpires. We also need to look at our team leaders and figure out. Cernan takes a crack. See if any of our team leaders are just kind of out of favor right now. Because if they are, then we need to possibly move them on. Because that can really upset the locker room. You know, those team leader guys not getting any play. All right, Krisnik, Matthews, Aslani. Oh, he was looking looking for Solaire over there. We're seeing some good ball movement. Some deft passing. It's hard to really gauge anything at this level because I don't know anything about this team. And disallowed for an offsides. I don't think the goal scorer was offsides. Must have been some interference by Cernan. Yeah, see, Cernan, what, well, yeah, I guess it did. That's disappointing. Seven shots. They've got zero. We are playing attacking football. Cernan's there. Cannot find the finish. I really, I'm really going to have to pick a striker and stick with them, and I, you know, whichever one it is, especially if we're only going with one striker. Cernan looks like he is struggling. He's got the goal. He's playing a seven-four, but we're not getting a whole lot out of his chances. Sam makes a drop-in pass. Matthews can't get it around the defender. But they're, they're really compacted in their end. A lot of people in the box for them. There's Lynch. It's good to see our, our new center back pairing. I certainly did not expect to open this year with, uh, with new center backs. Let me look at something here real quick. Cernan has an eight heading. Jack Hunter has an 11, but can't jump. Has Lonnie a 10 heading, and he can jump very well. So let's put mixed crosses in. Tell you what, yeah, Cernan can play out on the right. He's not as good a crosser. I just want to kind of take a look at him in the, you know, see if that increases. And already, you know, we've got a header that goes on target, made, you know, forced to play at least. Another header. That one was by Doyle, I believe, knocked away by the keeper. Lynch sends it wide. Come on, boys. Over the top. There's Aslani. Oh, and what? That's a deft finish. His first goal of the season. I don't know. Does that make my decision for me? Because he looked really deft with that finish. Very precise. Oh, there's Saren coming in from the wing. Making it count. His second of the game. Gotta like that. Maybe that's our partnership here. All right, that was a poor clearance. As Lonnie gets it back to the back line. So, yeah, you're always kind of. Oh, was Sam? Was he on sides? I think he was. First goal of the season, that was a great break by him. Look at that, he just took off right there, boom. 
Great, great anticipation on that play. Great vision from the center back, Lynch, with the assist. And it's now 4-0. I think we're going to drop back to balance just to kind of relax a little bit. And we are going to drop some praise on the team. Not sure how good this team is, That's as I was saying. Oh, as Lonnie got in the way, he was off sides there. That was a little poor. 66% possession, 91% pass completion. Boy, they are just jam-packed in that box, aren't they? My goodness. I think we're going to make a couple of subs here at the half. Maybe bring in some of our younger players. There's Yashin. We'll give him, he could be a Mazala. Let's bring him on for Doyle. Takahashi is one hell of a passer. And he's a team leader. Let's bring him in for Matthews. We'll just do that one for right now. You know, we'll do those two for right now. Um, I'm going to go hands together. Keep it up. Do have some complacency. But we'll have to watch out for that. Yeah, Yashin's already complacent. He just came in. Um, focus. And Abwander, that's, uh, that's our new center back. I was like, who is that? That's our new German center back. A uh, little half volley. That was brilliant. Makes it 5-0. I'm not, I'm not putting too much stock into this game. Just mainly I don't know who these guys are. And, you know, this is probably a game that we should have won, right? Sahin into the box. Saren. See, there's another shot by Saren that, you know, that's not right in front of goal that just goes way wide of the mark. There's a header. Oh, that did not go over the line. Oh, my goodness. That's a little surprising. Knocked away. Good job. Look at the goals just spaced all over the pitch. The assist as well. There's a header off target. We've sent a lot of headers over the goal, but we've done that pretty much all season. I'm pretty sure this is what would happen to us. There's Aslani going up for a header. If we were playing in, like, Champions League, you know, I think that would be a result like this. Or throw in. All right, I'm going to make another sub here. Who? I bring Cernan off. Well, Yopex out there. What about Yashin? I just brought him in. He can pass really well. He can cross. He's right-footed. Do I have another mid center? Neil Coley's there. Tell you what, I'm gonna bring off. Um, well, Solaire's looking jaded. Uh, let's bring Jack Hunter on for him. Get a look at that trio. Saren with another one that goes off target. Hunter, could, Hunter and Sorare, we could be happy with either one of them. That was another, that was another punch out instead of grabbing it. Don't like that. Not the best play. All right, let's praise. That cheers everybody up. Takahashi. But we actually have quite a couple of, uh, you know, Asian, you know, we've got 
Japanese player in Takahashi. And then we've got, oh, they tried to clear that and it bounced right back like a howitzer at the keeper. That would have been a heck of an own goal. And then we've got uh, Park Hyung, the uh, Korean player, South Korean. They sold a lot of jerseys last year. All right there's Sam. Is he going to take a crack at it? Yes, he is. Not the best person to be doing that. But he is a good distributor. They're playing a 4 2 3 1 with a narrow front three. We're playing the wide. Okay, there's a grab instead of a punch out. Kudos. Wow, this game is seeming to last forever. Yes, just way too many highlights. 30 shots, 15 on target, an XG in excess of 4, and we score 5. That's a good way to start the season. A nice victory, well done. We still have transfer window time. Like I said, I'm not putting much stock into this game at all. I don't even know what league that is. Wandsbecker, TSB, Concordia. Semi, uh, Semi-pro team. Yeah, we probably should have scored 12. Now I'm, now I'm really concerned. <laughs> now I'm really concerned. Are they the team that won last year? Wandsbeck, Concordia. Past winners. They won the Polkle Cup last year. Okay, that's interesting. I feel bad that we didn't win last year now. Uh, Abwander scores on his debut. Quite a few other debuts. Krisnik, Lynch, DeVos, Sorer, Doyle, Matthews, Yashin. 258000 for the Polkel first round. One goal, one assist, six assists, or six passes. So we'll give him a passing and that's about it. All right, so 5-0. We'll open up with the Bundesliga. Let's come back for uh let's come back pretty quickly. We'll come back for Bachum and Dresden to open our Bundesliga season. Uh Pokal's second round is down here, so that may be our next match. Maybe we'll do uh Bayern Munich highlights if there are any. Uh, and then Pokal second round, or maybe we play Bayern Munich and show Pokal highlights. Something like that. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, interested to see how the transfers start gelling. Uh, we still have good cohesion. Everything else is in there. Oh, we did pick up, uh, it was Aslani that came up into the leadership group, so that was actually good. And I think that tells me I need to play him. Um, now the big thing is, what do I do with everybody else? Now, I only have 16 players supporting me, so quite a few players. Sam's been here. Kramer's been here. Pavnovich has been here. Yanderson. Now, he may have just gotten benched. Yashin's new. Samson, who I'm trying to get rid of. Uh, Matthews is new. And Park Hume. So, yeah, we our squad is a little deep. But not horribly so. I mean, if you look, this is our club. It's only one screen, right? So it's not a horribly deep squad. Really only gives us seven extra players. And let's see. Not at club. Yep, so we'll take out him. Uh, Ricardo Vaz had just come back from that broken leg. It was training and pulled some knee ligaments, so he's out again. He'll be out three more weeks. So, who should I start? Should I start DeVos, the new keeper, 24 years old? Or should I start Yanderson, the 26-year-old Brazilian that we paid $13 million for? Uh, they're, they're on, you know, $299 a month and $211 a month. So, not a huge difference. One's worth $28 million, One's worth $6.5 I don't know. We'll see. All right, guys. Bye.